Hey YouTube, this is Shonky91. Uh, I have a, uh, another video for you here about uh, Parallel's uh, desktop for uh, the iPad and the iPhone. Uh, today what I'm going to be showing you is uh, Ubuntu Linux 10.04. As you can see right above that I actually have Windows 7 which is suspended which you know, really shows you how you, know, you could have a nice list over here of operating systems that you could really stream right onto the iPad. So I'm going to go ahead and click it, dismiss the tips, and as you can see, I'm on the Ubuntu 10.04 desktop. Uh, now what I should mention is, is that in the first video that I posted, I said that Ubuntu Linux did have a lot of trouble uh, with the touch. Um, I actually, it was a little bit tricky, uh, but I was able to get the, uh, the parallels, uh, the desktop, uh, desktop tools installed. And again, just like in Windows 7, once you install the desktop tools, uh, all, the, um, <clears throat> all the touch problems were wrong. My only complaint with Ubuntu Linux 10.04 on the iPad is that in comparison to Windows 7, there's quite a, quite a big drag, uh, not a drag, a lag, um, for, especially for character entry. Uh, you can see that if I enter a character here on my keyboard, you, know, you can hear me typing, and the letters are slowly making their way in. I, throw a space, there's about a two to three second lag between what's going on on the actual desktop over here and what's going on in Ubuntu Linux down here. Otherwise though everything still you know works really nicely and I have no, uh, no major complaints other than uh, that there's uh, quite a bit of lag uh, but uh, this was not difficult to do. Again, all you really have to do is you have to go onto your desktop into Parallel 6. Uh, to my knowledge, this will only work with Parallel 6. Parallels 5 will not do it. Um, and once you're inside Parallels desktop, all you have to do is you have to go up to the menu up here where it says Parallels desktop. You hit preferences and then you'll see some tabs at the top over here you're gonna to want to go to the mobile one and all you have to do is log in with your parallels email address here uh, it's gonna be it's blocked off in the video here but uh, then all you do is you click the lock and you're good to go this has been Shonky91 and if you have any questions or comments please feel free to leave them in the comment section below bye bye